a win against the Phoenix Suns, 117 to 107. Tatum leading them in that game with 29 points, 10 points. Horford to screen, screen and roll, knockdown, ball caroms free, diving for it, Grant. Pritchard picks it up, 2 nothing Boston. The program his father started, they became a national power, led by Peyton's hard work. And he's going to be going against a guard like Anthony Simons. Of uh, Aiton, Blazers will bring it across. Aiton will run up the floor, face up on Horford, and get to that sweet spot 15 feet straight away and knock it down. Yeah. Simons surveying, lobs it low, pinning White inside as Aiton. Coming in in the second wave is Horford to deflect it, actually get the block. Albeit a great defensive guard in Derek White, but still DeAndre is supposed to win that matchup. Derek White leans into a triple and knocks it down. He's shooting. Just Denver winning the matchup on Thursday in Denver. 115-109. Jokic, 32 points, 12 rebounds, 11 assists. Boston first must solve that mystery. Trying to guys on the perimeter and then also stop their passing, particularly when they got teammates who shoot the three the way that Scoot apparently wants to shoot it. Henderson draws the Blazers to within two. Tatum goes to work. Simons on him. Quickly turns and finds Horford spreading the floor with his ability to shoot. Yeah, he was sitting in the help position because he knew Tatum could do this shoot over the top of Anthony Simons. And so Tatum made the pass the time before. Now the something you give him enough opportunities, he's going to be solid. He's going to shoot the ball well. He's going to make the right decisions. Almost sounds like I'm talking about Anthony Simons. Kamara, 5-0. And Scoot Henderson on the floor. It's Richard mm -hmm. stepping through and a beautiful lob up top to the big man. Of the shooters like Dwap running into the play. Tatum works his way inside with that inside out left hand dribble drive. Pritchard puts his head down, nice into the lane to the glass. Lobs it again up top, and it's Hauser again at the rack. He collects Reef, who goes down in a heap. Scoot Henderson sets up on a Reef screen into the lane to the glass. Unfurls a finger roll, but well defended in there by Cornett. They break out with Pritchard. Find and Tatum on the trail for the two-hand jam. But the Blazers were not able to cash in, and here's Hauser trailing. Now, Kev, 85 and a half percent of Hauser's career shots. 819 field goal attempts have come from the three-point line. But Boston has the defenders to kind of force you into it, especially when Porzingis and Holiday are playing. Ooh. Cornette, a solid screen setter. Tatum meanders into the... He'll come up to screen on Simons. Brown off the pick. Simons under the screen. Brown into the lane. Running right-hander up and in for the 6'6", Jalen Brown. Solid stop there by the Blazers, and it started with Simons not allowing Brown to get to the bucket. And now they come back, and they go to your point. Changes his mind in midair. Scoop will fire that one off the yard, and the rebound grabbed by the Boston Celtics. Tatum quickly to White. Has men strung out. Goes one on three down. In transition, that's the ninth most in the NBA. So they're either off and running, or they're picking you apart in the half court with the three-point shooter. Speaking of three-point shooting, how about Matisse Thibault? And in the near corner is Chris Murray. That was a good coaching call from the sidelines from Coach Billups and company. They came out in a zone look, knowing the Celtics. That was bothered by Matisse Thibel. At least he appeared to be bothered. Here's Simons coming off the screen for Mayton. Reworks it and yeah. knocks down a triple. He, he is one of the pull to win in five. Brown has a block by Thibel, recovered by Brown, strolls into the lane Ooh. and snakes a hook with the left hand. Simons off a screen, good close closeout by White. Blazer bench thought he'd been fouled. Here they come the other way after the turnover and the Boston Celtics score on a three on two. In it comes on the rookie Murray, straight arms and turns the corner, gains the edge, two-hand jam. That's just the way things worked out because Boston, no matter who gets it, that person can start the break. They don't give you a chance to get the matchups you want. Operating on a double team, jump pass to Brown, slashes in, draws contact, laid it up and in through the contact. Brown was 17 in the first half. That's coming in there on that exchange on a handoff to Grant. Here's Henderson into the lane. Flicks a high lob in there to eight. Gain space on White, and it flushes a two-hand. Uh, you got five sets of eyes on White. Off it comes to Brown, drives into the lane, nice to the glass. And the acrobatic Brown takes yeah. four. Murray with it. Trips out of backcourt. Into the lane, regains his balance and lays it in over Pritchard. Yeah. Scoop the three, long rebound Pritchard, downhill, Tatum two-hand jam, four on one.
That time, Boston. These are shooting at a reasonable clip at 47% from the field. Richard off the screen. Gives to Tatum. Had a notion. Now we'll drive it. Three defenders and finger rolled it up. And had an open three. He just took his time and knew he was going to get to the bucket regardless. Brown just wards off anybody that's smaller than him. Tamani, if he cuts, he's got a lob. Eight single coverage, spinning into a corkscrew fade. Guys, the Texas Legends did get the win, but the guys stayed the entire time. They were up on their feet, like I mentioned, cheering on their friends. It's really important for them to know that, yes, they are in their town. And when they have the day off, they will choose to spend it supporting them. I thought that was great. But when was the illegal contact? And they say, nope, common foul, play on. Scoop with a bucket. Third foul on White. As Scoop. And the tip controlled by Henderson up the floor, behind the back, into the lane to the glass. Lay it up and in. Grant works up into front court and sees Brown standing there. He'll take him into the paint. Rolls in there with a bank right-hander from the left side. Opening up the hit. They're one of the harder teams when you switch to get underneath, to position your body between them and the bucket. And if you don't do that, they get an offensive rebound, they get another look at it. Has more than him with 23. But even if he doesn't get his hands on it, he's going to be near it, enough to bother. Okay, drop. We can put it on the floor with comfort and get to that bucket. Hauser like left unattended, oh, a three man. is up and in. Tatum. On the cornet screen, into the lane, backs off Reef and lays it home. On Kamara, and he comes. The 6'8 Kamara defends, but he finds a way. Tatum. Tatum cranks in the deep one and a bank. Henderson behind the back. Ran into traffic, lost the handle, walked it the other way. Hauser, catch, shoot, three, drilled it. Simons comes down with it. Quickly hit to Banton. Banton good at getting into the paint. Nice lob on the run. Aiden collects it above the rim and laid it in. Kamara on Pritchard. Little hesitation. That's a good hesitation. Deeks and drives That's and lays it up. And it's just yeah. that little shimmy. Yeah, he's got that. Anthony Simons sees a double to Kamara. Centering pass to Henderson. Hits it deep on White, hesitates, leans back and scores. Tatum working, seeing a double tip. Kamara trying to reach in. Tatum spins away from that pressure and takes Simons in deep. Friends, watch your favorite teams on Root Sports and Root Sports Plus using the app. DeAndre Ayton does it when he's not grabbing a big numbers for DA tonight. 22 and 12. Boston on top by 16. He was able to score that last bucket because Horford did not get underneath the switch. <laughs> on the inbounds, Gramble handle. From the key, that may be the easiest shot for percentage in the league. But yet they're still so difficult to guard. But those kind of looks right there, those are the bonus looks. Tom Haverstroh, what about that? That matchup with Denver didn't go so well over the weekend, but hey, it's one game. Well, even a game when DeAndre went out with the hand injury, he had a double-double in that game before yes. going out early. It was terrific. So he, he has been a consistent bright spot. For the Boston Celtics, Pritchard stays on. B.D. Davidson on the floor. Celtics go to 50 and 14 on the year, 21 and 11 on the road. The Blazers go to 18 and 46 for the season, 10 and